Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. In today's video I'm going to show you how to free up space and get rid of unwanted files and apps on your Fire Stick. So let's get started. Alright, so after a period of time of using your Fire Stick and downloading apps and doing what you do on your Fire Stick, you'll realize that you're running a bit low on storage space. So it's a good idea every once in a while to clean out unnecessary and unwanted files and applications. And when you do that, your Fire Stick will run much better. Uh, so today in this video, I'm going to show you two ways of doing that. Um, so the first thing you need to do is from your home screen, go up to your menu, go over to settings, go down and go over to My Fire TV. It might, it might say device or device and software and click on that. Go down to developer options, click on that. And we need to turn these two settings on. ADB debugging, click on that, turn it on. Go down and click on apps from unknown sources and then turn that on. Once you've done that, hit your home button, go back home. And for this video, we're going to use File Linked to download an app called SD Made. SD Made is a uh, scanner and a cleaner for your Fire Stick. So if you don't have File Linked, I will leave a link in the description where you can download and install it. But I will show you how to quickly get it here. If you go over to your downloader app and click on it and type in getfilelinked.com and hit go, you will then it will then download and then you can install it. Just follow the instructions, very simple and easy, but we're not going to do that because I already have it installed, so I'm just going to go back home. I'm going to go down and open file linked and type in this code. This is a code for my file link store. It's 804-88262. Once you've done that, hit continue. And once you're in, you might get a couple pop-ups and just dismiss that. And what you need to do is go to the search icon, little magnifier on the right, and then go over to your left with your button and click with your center button and search for SD Made. What I'm going to do is just type in SD and hit Next. And you'll see SD Made comes right to the top. So I'm going to hit the down arrow that will download it. Once it's done downloading, hit that the play arrow that will install it and hit install. And once you're done, hit open. And SD Made will open. Um, this app does have a lot of features on it, but I'm not going to get into those today. I'm just going to show you how to do a quick scan and um, how to get rid of some files. So if you go down and highlight scan and click on it, this will pop up. It's uh, You need a few steps are necessary until you can use SD Made. So go down and highlight next and click on it. And then it's asking for access to storage. So click allow. Highlight it and click it. And then if you have the 4K, it might ask you this. So just click Allow again. And then go down and highlight Done. And click on that. And it will start to scan your system for files. All right, that was a pretty quick scan. As you can see, it's, when you go down to the Run Now, I can get rid of 41 megabytes of files. So if you just click on that, It'll ask for confirmation, just click Run, and it will clean out that 41 megs of file. Now your system might have more, might have less, depends on how long you've been using it and how many different files you've downloaded. So um, that's the quick and easy way that frees up a little bit of space. But now I'm going to show the other way of doing that. 
So we're just going to get out of this, get out of file linked. And we're back at our home screen. And once you're back at your home screen, go up to your menu again and go all the way over to settings and go down and over to applications. Highlight that and click on it. Go down to manage installed applications and click on that. As you can see, I only have 9.93 gigs left of my storage, so I don't have much left. So we're going to get rid of some applications here. So click on that. That will bring you in to show you all your installed applications. Now, you can just scroll through all these applications and find what you don't need and it will free up space for you. So I'm just going to go in and find, I don't use this too much, so I'm just going to click on that. Go down to uninstall, click on that, and click uninstall. And that will free up some more space. So you can go down to another, any of these apps and do that. Um, we'll just go to, what do we got here? We'll just click on this for the heck of it. So you click on that and go down, uninstall. And that's going to get rid of 45 megs of space. So we'll uninstall that. And that freed up a bit of space for you. So once you've done that, go back. And if you go back into Manage Installed Applications, and another good thing to do is go up into any of these apps and click on it, and go down to Clear Cache. And as you can see, there's a, you could free up, depending on the app, you know, this has a minimal amount of space, but we'll hit Clear Cache. And you can see the cache goes to zero. So go back and do that with with any other apps or all the apps if you like clear cache this is already clear so we'll go back we'll click on cinema HD cache is cleared on that so that's another way of freeing up space so if you see I now have over a gig of free space I could free up more space but for the sake of this video I'm just going to delete so much and you basically get the idea. So, um, like I said, it's a, we'll go back home. It's a really a good idea to do this every so often because your fire stick will get bogged down with just junk files. And, you know, sometimes over a period of time, you don't realize how much you've downloaded and what you're not using. So it's a good idea to, like I said, clean house every so often. It will make your fire stick run much better and much faster. So that's about it for this video today. So um, hope you liked it. And if you did, you know, give us a little like and hit the thumbs up button. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon. And also, if you have any comments or questions, please feel free to leave some. And uh, until the next time, be safe and be good. We'll see you. Bye.